What does this mean for their relationship? And how does it connect to his recent split with Jello? Stay tuned as we uncover all the details and explore the complicated dynamics between these Hollywood stars. Recently, the internet exploded with news of Ben Affleck and Jennifer Lopez finalizing their divorce. The couple, who married in 2023 after rekindling their romance, decided to part ways in July 2024. While the reasons behind their split remain somewhat private, the pressures of public scrutiny and demanding careers likely played a part. Their whirlwind romance and subsequent marriage had the public in a frenzy. But like many high-profile relationships, it struggled to survive under the harsh spotlight. Adding another twist to this tale, Jennifer Garner was recently spotted helping her ex-husband, Ben Affleck, move into his new $20 million bachelor pad in the Pacific Palisades. Garner's unexpected involvement has sparked curiosity and various speculations about the current state of their relationship. Many have questioned what this means for Affleck and Garner. Are they simply maintaining a strong co-parenting relationship, or is there more beneath the surface? In a recent interview, Ben Affleck was asked to clarify his thoughts on marriage being described as work. He responded, well, yeah, it's a way that we talk privately about how committed we are to our marriage. Not sure why you had to share it live to a billion people, but our marriage is the work of love. His response seemed to reflect a deeper understanding of the complexities involved in maintaining a relationship, perhaps hinting in his own experiences with both Jennifer Garner and Jennifer Lopez. Ben Affleck and Jennifer Garner's relationship dates back to 2004 when they met on the set of Daredevil. Their marriage, which seemed like a fairy tale from the outside, faced many challenges behind the scenes. Both had demanding careers that often kept them apart, and the media attention and paparazzi intrusion added more strain to their relationship. Despite these pressures, they managed to keep a united front for their children and their fans. However, in 2015, they announced their separation, and their divorce was finalized in 2018. Unlike many Hollywood splits, they maintained a cordial relationship. Garner's support for Affleck was evident, especially during his struggles with sobriety. She stood by him through rehab stints and personal challenges, showcasing a strong co-parenting relationship. This brings us to recent events. Just weeks after his divorce from Lopez was made public, Jennifer Garner was seen helping Ben Affleck move into his new home. This act of kindness and support has reignited interest in their relationship, prompting fans and media to speculate about the nature of their bond. The sighting at the Pacific Palisades home was not just a fleeting moment. Garner spent several hours at the property actively helping Affleck unload boxes and furniture. This gesture has led many to believe that despite their divorce, they share a deep bond that goes beyond co-parenting. It's also a reminder of the strong foundation they built during their 13-year marriage. I couldn't do any of the things I do without your support. You're my angel, my life, and my world, Affleck said in a heartfelt moment, indicating the deep connection and gratitude he still feels toward Garner. This kind of acknowledgement goes beyond simple co-parenting. It hints at a relationship that, while no longer romantic, still holds a significant emotional connection. Throughout their years together, Garner and Affleck were often seen as a team. They balanced their successful careers while raising three children, navigating the ups and downs of Hollywood life. Even after their split, they continued to prioritize their children's well-being, attending school events and family outings together. This commitment to their family has always been at the forefront of their actions. Their divorce in 2018 marked the end of an era, but it was handled with grace and mutual respect. They avoided the typical Hollywood drama, focusing instead on creating a stable environment for their children. This mature approach to their separation has been a significant factor in maintaining their friendship and collaborative co-parenting. So when Garner was seen helping Affleck with his move, it wasn't entirely surprising to those who have followed their journey. It highlighted their ability to put their differences aside and support each other during significant life transitions. This act, especially so soon after Affleck's divorce from Lopez, speaks volumes about their relationship. It suggests a level of trust and understanding that has endured despite the romantic aspect of their relationship ending. It also raises the question, is there still a possibility for them to rekindle their romance? Comparing Ben Affleck's relationships with Jennifer Garner and Jennifer Lopez, reveals different aspects that have influenced his life and public image. Garner and Affleck's relationship was characterized by its longevity and the family they built together. 
their marriage, which lasted from 2005 to 2018, saw them navigating the complexities of Hollywood life while raising three children. Their relationship was often seen as a stabilizing force in Ben's life, especially during his struggles with addiction. Garner's support during these times highlighted a partnership built on mutual care and responsibility. In contrast, Affleck's relationship with Lopez, both in the early 2000s and during their recent reunion, was marked by intense public scrutiny and media frenzy. Benefer 2.0, as it was dubbed, brought a wave of nostalgia and excitement, but also immense pressure. Their high-profile engagement and subsequent marriage in 2023 were widely celebrated, but the constant media attention may have added strain. The glamour and intensity of their relationship, while captivating for fans, lacked the same foundation of everyday partnership that characterized his marriage to Garner. The influence of these relationships on Affleck's public image is notable. With Garner, Affleck often appeared as a dedicated father and partner, navigating personal challenges with a supportive spouse. The media frequently highlighted their family moments and Garner's support during his rehab stints. In contrast, his relationship with Lopez brought back his status as a Hollywood heartthrob, but also resurrected past controversies and the pressures of being in the spotlight. In the wake of his divorce from Jennifer Lopez, Ben Affleck has moved into a new chapter of his life, quite literally. He recently purchased a $20 million bachelor pad in the upscale Pacific Palisades neighborhood of Los Angeles. This luxurious home boasts 13,000 square feet of living space, six bedrooms, nine bathrooms, a pool, and panoramic views of the Pacific Ocean. It's a significant move for Affleck, marking his first time living alone since his split from Jennifer Garner in 2018. But what caught everyone's attention wasn't just the house itself. It was the unexpected assistance from his ex-wife, Jennifer Garner. Eyewitnesses reported seeing Garner at Affleck's new home, helping him unload boxes and furniture from a moving truck. She spent several hours at the property, actively participating in the move-in process. This sighting has sparked a flurry of speculation and renewed interest in their relationship. Garner's involvement in Affleck's move is particularly intriguing given the recent timeline. Just weeks after his divorce from Lopez was finalized, Garner's presence at his new home suggests a strong bond and mutual support system despite their past and the public nature of their split. However, some people believe that Garner and Affleck might be rekindling their romance pointing to their history of strong emotional connection and shared family responsibilities. Others argue that Garner is simply being the supportive ex-wife and co-parent, helping Affleck during a transitional period in his life. Media outlets have been quick to jump on these speculations, with headlines suggesting everything from a possible reunion to an example of exceptional co-parenting. Sources have highlighted the maturity and mutual respect between Garner and Affleck, suggesting that their actions set a positive example for handling post-divorce relationships. Social media has been buzzing with reactions. One user wrote, seeing Jennifer Garner help Ben Affleck move is the definition of maturity and grace. Another added, do you think Ben and Jen might get back together? This move and help is pretty suspicious. While the nature of Garner's involvement remains a topic of debate, it is clear that their relationship continues to captivate fans. Looking into the potential reasons behind Jennifer Garner's decision to help Ben Affleck during his move opens up a range of possibilities. One of the most plausible explanations is the nature of their co-parenting relationship. Over the years, Garner and Affleck have emphasized the importance of maintaining a stable and supportive environment for their three children, Violet, Serafina, and Samuel. This commitment has often translated into public displays of unity, such as attending school events and family outings together even after their divorce. Garner's involvement in Affleck's move could be seen as an extension of this co-parenting dynamic. By helping him transition into his new home, she might be ensuring that their children have a smooth adjustment to the new living arrangements. This act of support could also indicate a continued friendship and mutual respect which has been evident in their interactions post-divorce. Both have publicly stated their dedication to co-parenting effectively, and this move could be another step in that direction. Another potential motive could be rooted in their long history together. Despite the ups and downs, Garner and Affleck share a deep bond forged over 13 years of marriage. Garner's willingness to assist might come from a place of genuine care and concern for Affleck's well-being, 
especially considering his recent struggles with sobriety and the emotional toll of his high-profile divorce from Jennifer Lopez. The dynamics between Affleck and Garner reflect a relationship built on mutual respect and a shared goal of providing a stable environment for their children. This recent act of Garner helping Affleck move could also be viewed through the lens of their commitment to their children's well-being. By maintaining a close and supportive relationship, they can ensure that their children feel secure and loved, despite the changes in their family structure. The story of Ben Affleck and Jennifer Garner is a testament to the complexities of modern relationships, particularly in the spotlight of Hollywood. Their ability to navigate personal challenges and maintain a positive relationship post-divorce is commendable and serves as a model for others. As fans continue to speculate on the nature of their bond, one thing remains clear. Garner and Affleck have built a relationship that transcends the typical narrative of Hollywood breakups. Their story highlights the importance of compassion, respect, and putting family first, even in the face of adversity. But what do you think about Jennifer Garner helping Ben Affleck move on from Jello? Do you think it's a sign of a potential reconciliation? Or is it simply a supportive gesture from a co-parent friend? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more celebrity updates and insights.